All right, so I want to talk about uh, these Bose headphones. They are uh, basically Bose's first headphones that came out, um, I believe. Uh, it does say right on that side and then left, so that you do know which side of which side of ears to put them on. But these are the uh, now they do come. These are the blue, the glacier blue, and they do have silver, but um. These headphones are pretty sweet. They basically they are uh, uh, noise canceling, as far as I know. Um, these are the Bose Triport. Now they have the Bose uh, Quiet Comfort, which you can put in, you can put batteries into them and all that. Um, but these are just not. They're basically self powered by uh, whatever you put them into or whatever you connect, like your iPod or computer speakers or whatever. Walkman, whether it's a cassette Walkman or a CD Walkman or whatever. Um, you know, they are worn down a little bit because they've been used, which is a good thing. But um, Sony does make some really good headphones. They make studio quality, professional grade headphones. But these, uh, I've actually had, you know, a few pairs of these because it's the first pair, um, unfortunately, one of the speakers in one of the, one of the sides uh, stopped working for some reason. And then uh, the second pair, I forget what happened to that, but uh, um, I ended up getting, uh, you know, the second pair was, was free because the warranty was still on. But um, these speakers, with them being Bose and all that, with them being like old, they still work really good and they still have really good sound. But I found out that uh, I have some earbuds that I use and I found out that those work a little bit better than these. Only because I don't want to hear any noises and sounds outside of what I'm listening to as far as music goes. Because when I'm listening to music, I just want to be, just hear the music and that's it. I don't want to hear anything else. I don't want to hear random noises. Um, the difference between noise isolation and noise canceling is that noise canceling, to me, like, you can still hear a little bit of sound outside of what you're listening to as far as earbuds or headphones. But noise isolation is like, you can't hear anything. You're just hearing the music and that's it. So, to me, that's what the difference is. Um, yeah, Bose, they make really good products, but unfortunately, nowadays, they're really expensive. So, I would say getting a, uh, getting, um, <laughs> getting, like, some Bose headphones nowadays is just, in my opinion, a waste of money. You're almost better off getting, like, some Beats or some Sonys or something like that that are equivalent to what the Boses are today. Because um, Bose, you can, you, you can spend as much as... Three, four, five hundred dollars. Uh, I think it's the top of the line ones are like five, four hundred dollars. But uh, and they're like you know wireless. They're battery operated, noise canceling and stuff. And I think you can even um, do some special stuff with them. I don't know exactly, but these, these uh, and the good thing is with these is that I got a uh, a um, a uh, gold plated uh, jack for. Um, the bigger, like, uh, I think it's like a quarter inch, uh, jack. And, and then I got the tip of this end for the smaller ones. Um, this is, uh, gold. So it helps better with, uh, connection and, um, just, um, so, but it, it's, the cord is pretty long, so which is pretty sweet. So really like the headphones, I mean, these are pretty good for listening to music and playing along to with. Well, if you're doing a guitar cover or a drum cover, um, you can still hear music. You can still hear what you're playing on the outside of the, the headphones, but you can still hear the music on when you're listening to whatever. Um, but they're they're pretty sweet still, and I still have them. And I uh, the first time I had them, it was way 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 back when I was younger and all that. And I I just sound has been a big deal for me, whether it's you know, inside the home or in a car, it's just been, you know, a big deal to me as far as like, you know, listening to, to music and stuff. Cause not only you have to have, you know, good, um, quality, uh, songs as far as like, you know, the whole recording and whatnot, but you also have to have good, you know, speakers and all that, whether it's subs or amps in the car, but, uh, you know, vehicles that come with Bose, sound systems, all that, they're pretty good. So, but these are, uh, they're still going strong and I still use them.